Okay, here we go. Uh, good afternoon, I'm Daniel. And before I start, I would like to thank me and Kate and the uh, people at Linux Foundation, the, the real-time working group, to because, to making this event possible. We generally have two events about real-time during the year. We have the, the real-time microconference inside the LPC, where we discuss more what is coming and uh, the new developments and put people together to, to fight on discussions. And we have the real-time Linux Summit, where it's a, a more easygoing conference, where the idea is to, to build community, to explain how things work, to bring new ideas, and, uh, and be more easygoing. So that's the, the idea of the event here. We have the people here in the room, and we have the people in the virtual room. <clears throat> and uh, I please ask for when you have any questions. You can stop on the presentation if you have some, something to discuss. Always keep things respectful. Everybody has the right to, to ask questions, and uh, we are here to help each other. That's the idea. Uh, when making questions, please wait for the microphone to arrive because we can have the people in the virtual room interacting as well so they can, can, can hear what we are discussing here, right? And yes, the idea is to be easygoing and, and to build community. So we... <clears throat> We have a, a, a set of talks here, and uh, we start with, cycli with uh, cyclic test latency, find out with tracing where Stephen will, will talk about how to use his cool libraries to parse tracing and to find root causes. And then I'll talk about RTLA that uh, somehow goes into the same idea but expands and, and try to make things easy to use. And, uh, and, more, and yeah. So then we will have a talk that is uh, from the people working in the LISA working group, they have like uh, this requirement of having the real-time kernel on the safety critical systems. And they they need to build some, some knowledge, some shared knowledge on uh, how, how do we enable uh, real-time Linux on critical systems and to discuss with people about this. And that's the presentation that Shua and Elana will give to us. And they will be remote. Uh, so then we have a break, we have a coffee here, and uh, and then uh, after the break we have uh, John talking about proposing a new tracer to monitor real-time tasks, mainly when we have like to debug what, why is my real-time task not working properly and how, what, what can we do, and I think that this will be like more discussion-like presentation as far as I got, right? And uh, and finally we have the, the famous talk about <clears throat> making questions to Thomas Glexner. We can ask anything, but not about print and documentation, right? That's, that's a joke. <laughs> you can ask. <laughs> I invite someone to ask. <laughs> and that's it. <clears throat> we, I can now, we can start earlier and pass the word to Stephen, if you would like to start, yeah. And then we can have more flexible, uh, Time. Yeah. So. Yeah, Stephen has always has like. <clears throat> yeah. So, so the idea here is to be a flexible and. Uh, so, do you have a? Does it take HDMI? Okay, you can use the HDMI here, or you can use the USB. Yeah, it should both should work. 